This is Michael Drew Shaw. Welcome to a unique look behind the scenes at the live, on-location recording session of the Johnny Knorr Orchestra's exciting new record album. In 2010, Jerry Knorr accepted the baton from his father, the late Johnny Knorr, ensuring the continuation of the orchestra's long-standing tradition of big band music. Before we get started, let's set the stage, literally, with the venue, the historic River Raisin Center for the Arts in Monroe, Michigan. The center is dedicated to providing high-quality performing arts presentations, arts education, and professional support to local arts organizations. Founded in 1987 by a group of community leaders, the dream of the founders was the restoration of the Art Deco Monroe Movie Theater. The theater was opened in 1938 as a unique showplace for movies during the golden era of the film industry. Many afternoons and evenings, sellout houses of 1,200 patrons filled the seats. The theater thrived through the 40s and 50s and continued as a popular venue until 1975. As we watch and listen to the Johnny Knorr Orchestra perform for their new album, we'll share a nostalgic glimpse of the charismatic and legendary interior as it looks today. Jerry Knorr has been with the orchestra since its beginning in 1960. Under his direction, the orchestra maintains a 52-year tradition of listening and dancing enjoyment through its vast library of custom arrangements. Two vocalists round out the orchestra's variety to make the Johnny Knorr Orchestra a total big band experience. Between them on this so one. So we go da da. Yeah. Mike plays and then we get da. 